It can be confusing to buy a front load washer because they all look the same. But there's so many new features since your last purchase. In this video, you'll learn about the seven best front load washers to consider, including their features and reliability based on 48,326 service calls logged by our service department just last year. In fact, you'll see the reliability stats for all the major brands because waiting two to four weeks for a service call and a washer for your family is incredibly stressful. We'll show you the best models, their best features, and a few of their drawbacks as well. So you'll know which front load washer may be right for you. And yes, we'll even tell you which brands are better at eliminating mold, a common problem in front loads, as well as heavily marketed machines you shouldn't buy as well. Now let's look at the top seven. The first two are similar GE front load washers. I'll explain why I include both at the end of the video. GE recently redesigned their washers and created an incredibly worthwhile and popular machine with many unique features. These two are similar machines with the, with the 850 model being a bit larger at five versus 4.8 cubic feet. It has the overnight wash and dry for about 100 and 150 dollars more. Plus the washer will automatically set the drying cycle. Here's what they have in common. If you've ever had to change your child in a public place, those flip down baby centers are treated with microban to eliminate bacteria. G has incorporated the same microband technology in the gasket, dispenser, and draining system to prevent mold and mildew buildup in your washer. Odor block is another feature designed to eliminate moisture which can create mold if left standing. The washer vent is built into the door and the cycle spins the drum to create a vacuum effect and dry any residual moisture. G is newer, so it incorporates many of the best features of all the brands. Both machines are Wi-Fi enabled like LG and Whirlpool, so you can control them and get notifications when a cycle is finished. The washer will also communicate with the dryer to determine the proper drying cycle in the 850 series. Both Gs will feature a 32 load dispenser like Whirlpool since at the bottom of the machine. An auto dispenser will dispense the right amount of detergent at the right time. So you have the best of every brand plus microband and odor block. I mentioned the 850 being the best for capacity. There are bigger machines like the Samsung Flex at six cubic feet and the LG Mega Capacity at 5.8, but you're paying five to $800 more for essentially 0.8 to one cubic feet of capacity. Front load washers are the most affordable at 4.5 to five cubic feet. The WFW 8620 is one of the most featured washers available. Their new controls are a simple yet intuitive push button style. You can choose between 35 options, including steam, sanitize, and cold water along with Wi-Fi connectivity. Whirlpool has the longest spin up to 12 hours and no heat, so your clothes will stay fresh and not wrinkle. They also have a 40 load dispenser located at the bottom of the machine and it's the largest in the industry. Whirlpool has decent reliability after G and LG at over 9% service in the first year. The price is a bit high at $12.99 versus $9.99 to $11.99 for a comparable LG and GE. You do have the tub clean cycles like LG. Whirlpool has their similar A fresh cycle. However, they, like LG, do not have the comprehensive mold prevention like GE. You also cannot reverse the washer or dryer so the doors do not line up when stacked. LG has been one of the most popular laundry brands over the last decade. They were the first manufacturer with a modern stackable front load design 20 years ago. WM3400 may be their most basic unit, but it still has plenty of features and options. It has eight wash programs with six options for almost every type of fabric. The spin speed is even high for a front load at 1300. So the clothes come out drier out of the washer. LG and G are tied for the fastest in a full size. The WM3400 is 4.5 cubic feet. So it's average for a front load and is, and is the most reliable at less than 4% repair in the first year. LG's best feature may be its depth at, at only 30 and a half inches or about 1.25 inches less than the next shallower Samsung and up to three inches shallower than the others. So it's easy to stack or fit into tight closets. It's the lowest price model on this list, but here's what the 3400 is missing. You must measure detergent and add it yourself like unlike the others on this list. You do have a self-cleaning cycle with reminders after 40 washers. LG lacks the comprehensive bowl of prevention found in the GE washers. Wi-Fi makes sense for laundry. It will alert you when the wash is done so you don't have to stare at the machine for the last two to five minutes. The dryer does not have a reversible door, so the washer and dryer do not line up when stacked. Unlike the others on this list, 
The 3400 does not have a steam cycle. Steam helps loosen tough stains like grass or red wine. It's designed for stacking with the controls in the middle, not at the top. The wash dryer also has some incredibly useful technology, including one-touch controls and smart technology to remember your favorite cycles. The washer can set the dryer cycle and time for you. The machine uses AI with 300 sensors monitoring your wash with steam in both washer and dryer. It is steam in the washer and dryer and Wi-Fi enabled through the LG ThinQ app. Mule's Laundry is the most sophisticated appliance you can buy. Their honeycomb drum allows your fine washables to glide on a sheet of water. It is the only compact washer to dispense detergent caplets. It also has a 1600 RPM spin speed, so the clothes are almost spun dry in the washer. This Mule has 25 wash programs you can swipe through like your phone. It has the auto dispenser twin dose for for detergent and bleach to be dispensed properly, and you can even buy special formulations as well. Their intense wash cycle from more evenly distributes from the top and bottom rather than just the bottom like every other washer. The detergent and bleach also are mixed more evenly between the two pumps. Mila also includes Wi-Fi connectivity. Beko is the only set on this list with a vented and a heat pump option. Beko is the first in the U.S. with heat pump laundry. You may not have heard of Beko, but their washers have 15 cycles and 1400 RPM spin speed, second only to Mule at 1600 RPM. Their 5.2% service rating in the first year is excellent as well. LG is the most reliable at just under 4%. The average appliance needs service 9.5% of the time in the first year. The average front loader is about 6%. Front loaders are the most reliable major appliances only behind electric and gas ranges. However, the repair can be expensive for the direct drive motor. Just make sure that wherever you buy, there's a repair department or it can be easily arranged. Always check reviews. Often manufacturers will promote their most innovative and often most expensive machines. LG has a mega capacity to 5.8 cubic feet. You've probably seen in a pop-up on the internet, but it costs much more than a five cubic foot GE for only 0.8 cubic feet more. Samsung has their two-in-one washer but again, that second wash is only about one cubic feet, so you're paying twice as much for not much more capacity. Also, neither can stack, and their greater depth of 35 inches will be a problem replacing your current washer. You always want to start with what will fit in the space, as newer machines are probably larger than your existing washer. LG's the shallowest at 30 and a half inches. Availability will be an issue for the balance of 2022. LG, Whirlpool, and G all have good features, so you could buy any of them based on features and reliability. However, for best overall considering features and prices, you may want to consider the G or lower priced LG models. Click the link in the description to download our free washer buying guide to learn even more about the most recommended 